Welcome to Ron Will's Money Matters. Logistics is key for product producing businesses. Very key because you know what? I don't care what your product is. It could be books. It could be clothing. Hey, you can have an urban farm. You still got to get your stuff to the market. You still got to get it to other places. Even if the logistics is packing your stuff into the trunk of your car and taking it to different stores. And I can relate to that because in my publishing business, when I was relying just on book sales, yes, I would have to take some books to uh, a store, get them shipped by UPS to different places, different distributors to places like Amazon. But at the same time, part of my logistics was just packing them into my car and taking them, taking them to local bookstores. So that's still logistics. Logistics is just moving products from one place to the other. In fact, that's that's been a big problem. They're not talking about it as much lately, but the whole supply chain thing. You know, something's being made overseas and it's sitting out in the sea for a few months before it's even unloaded. Logistics is key. That's why sometimes that's even a great business. If you have a simple business just transporting stuff from one place to the other, you can make some money. In fact, an independent, like say you're an independent, uh, you have a truck and that's a great business. Think about it. You have a truck, you're a truck driver, license, and you have a box truck. Just one of those smaller type of trucks. Hey, you know how they have at uh, some of these places, Penske or U-Haul or something like that. But you have an independent truck nothing on it. You could actually offer services to small companies to take their products to different places. In fact, I knew someone um, years ago, he had a dream of doing that. I think he might've got into something else now, but it's very important because what good is having that product and it doesn't get to the market or it doesn't get overseas or it doesn't get to where it's going. Shoot, even something as big as Amazon, shoot, they got their own logistics fleet and it's just all it, seriously that's all it is getting the product from one place to the other usually getting it from the warehouse or even getting it to the warehouse and then the warehouse to the stores and i'm gonna tell you what i mean a lot of times we don't think about it because this the stuff is there and of course we have uh, bigger major fortune 500 companies like a ups fedex and actually some other companies who are actually delivering the products. But remember, it's very key. And like I said, it could be a business in itself. And trust me, that's something I actually thought about too, because one of the things I do is think about business, business, business. Okay, what other businesses can I create? In fact, um, one of the things I would probably, I need to really think about how to do this is really have just a business network and different people advertising their uh, uh, services and then getting people to that website. And that's something to work on because it's, you know, you have plenty out there, um, but I'm thinking in terms of, okay, let's get some actual business going. And that's something to work on. <laughs> that's going on my list, but it's key. Logistics is key. I want y'all to think about that. I want you to think about it. You got, say you have a farm. All right, you have a farm, you have food. Now, of course, yeah, you could pack it in, you can have your own logistics, you know, pack it into your truck or car and take it to different places. And a lot of local farmers do that. But what if you want to go even further? It's important how things get there. Because I'm going to tell you what, people talk about the economy, but I'm going to tell you the one group of people you don't want to go on strike. And those are truck drivers. <laughs> Those are truck drivers. Whenever you see these trucks going up and down the highway, that's logistics right there. They are delivering something. What happens if they can't deliver? Like if they have, and they might have a major union. I'm not sure. I'm not a truck driver. Any truck drivers, let me know what, uh, what y'all working with. Let me know what y'all working with because I'm not sure I'm not in that industry. And just in general, and this is just in general, let me go on a tangent real quick. If you're in an industry, and I, I might mention something, but I'll, I'll always mention I'm not as familiar with it because I don't work in it. Please feel free to share something. 
Because one thing in business, everything is a business. Everything is a business, okay? So please share it. So if anybody actually works in logistics, please share more information because all, all I can talk about now is just very general. Now, I know it from a general perspective, but there's probably a whole lot of things that go into it. There's a whole lot of things that go into it. I know when I was working retail, the logistics managers, that was major money. That's a major position because I mean, I mean, retail, major store stuff got to get to the store. <laughs> I don't worry about it till it's in. The, I don't worry about it till it comes off the truck and, I, you know, I got to move stuff around. But it has to get there to begin with. And I'm going to tell you what is key. If you I don't care. Like I said, I don't care what product you have. Like a service, you know, you, all you need is a vehicle and be able to provide it. All you need is a vehicle. And mm, I don't know. I don't know how much that counts as logistics. Uh, as I say, someone who has more expertise in it, please share whatever knowledge you have. But a product, I don't care what it is, the books. Because I was thinking about that. I was like, and like I said, I was thinking about it. I was like, man, yeah, I got to take my books to all this stuff. This is logistics. I got to uh, send it out. And in fact, like I said, I knew someone who had an interest in that. I actually did some work for him for one day. It was a courier service. But that's logistics. That's logistics. You know, getting documents like in the D.C. area, at least back in the day, I'm not sure how they're doing it now. They probably just transmit stuff electronically now. But and they, and they might anybody in the D.C. area, how do they still have that uh, bike messenger thing going? But that's logistics, getting documents from one law firm to the other. That's logistics. It's like how are you going to do it? It's basically how are you going to get one something from point A to point B? And it's key. If you have any product, you got to get it to, you got to get it to um, the distributor, to the store, however. And like I said, if it's local, it's logistics packing it into the trunk of your car and then taking it out. But it's very important. And I'm seriously, that's a business. Think about it. Like for some, and I know there's a lot of truck drivers who follow me. Consider, seriously, consider maybe getting a small truck or, you know, just a regular truck, investing in a truck and then offering uh, services to different businesses, offering services to people say, hey, you know what? You got this stuff I can deliver. You know, you might have somebody who makes products in their home or and they making so much they can't just go out and deliver it themselves, offer to deliver it. That would be a great business. And you got to have it because, like I said, if the truck drivers go on strike, <laughs> Oh, the economy will shut down. Look how much the supply chain issues have uh, dealt a blow to the economy. That's logistics. Because what good, how, how, how can, you see, 70% of the economy is consumer spending. How can they spend the money? I mean, how can people buy stuff, consume stuff, if it's not in the store? Because it's sitting in the car. The logistics weren't working the way that they needed to. And it's a very important business, key business. Like I said, truck drivers, salute to all of you. Because you keep, you're the life, you're the blood of this nation. These truck drivers on the road and stuff, that's the blood. You take, you stop the blood flow in a human being, they die. You stop these truckers from driving, can, the logistics, and that's just the truckers. Like I said, the logistics, someone who actually works in it, they probably say, yeah, there's a whole lot more. You know, whoever got a schedule, how they tracking it and everything. That's that's major. It's very important. So anyway, that's all I have for now. Let's go make that money. <laughs>